Hello, everybody. This is Brian DeMauer, and welcome back to Trades of Old 4. Yay! All right, hopefully everything has worked. It has. All right, so let's go, go, go. All right, welcome to Trains of Old 4. And today, we are joined by... You always have to say, let's go, go, go on a big and, world event. Her. Indeed I do! Anyway, welcome back to Trades of World, and I need to turn down the volume of the game because I forgot to do that. Okay, uh, turn down the volume to about uh, 12 should be quiet enough. Welcome to another yelling session. Indeed, welcome to another Trades of World 4 live stream. Uh, and today I have joined, we're actually joined by two special, special guests today. Yes, we have the hamster here. I don't want to be here. Uh -huh. And we also, of course, Ryan here as well. Hi. All right, so let's now get everything set up. Uh, I'm gonna put it into passenger. Uh, we'll release the brake a little bit. Uh, let's see, generator field needs to be turned on and reverser needs to be set forward. And I think that is everything. Uh, hang on, let's see the headlights. Headlights are already on, so yeah. All right, welcome to the Los Angeles Union Station, which is where we're starting our journey for today. And yes, you heard it right, look at that. It's a couple of Santa Fe F7s. Yay, look at that. And there's some other Metrolink trains here as well. All right, so let's open, or no, let's close the doors. Where is the Pacific Star Liner? Uh, it doesn't exist in this game. All right, let's go. All right, so welcome back indeed to Train Sim World 4, where today we're gonna be taking a look at the uh, one of the other new routes here in Train Sim 4, the Antelope Valley Line. Yes, indeed. We are driving an American route today. And yes, it is indeed. Oops. Wait, this thing has a speed limit of 12 miles per hour. That's interesting. Anyway, yeah, so welcome to the Antelope Valley Line here in Train Sim World 4. Um, and we're going to be doing on the full route today. Uh, yes, indeed, we are. So the plan for this live stream is actually pretty simple. Drive this passenger train the entire route from LA to... L and how long is that? Uh, I totally didn't just run a red signal already, right as we literally just started. Crony. Hey, I thought it would, I thought it turned green already. I was! All right, well, we're up to an absolutely smashing soda that already ran a red light as we just started. So now we gotta start all over again. Hooray. Oh my god, you're so stupid. Uh, all right, once again, passenger, generator fields. Yep. But as we can see, the, uh, the F7 in action. Look at that. F7, Santa Fe, yeah. Look at that. Look how cool it looks, too. Wait, what? Yeah! Ryan. Yeah? You like classic diesels? Eh, classic diesels are boring. Yeah, I'm alive! F7's cool. That's, like, that's very okay. generic. Yeah, I'm alive! I wow, guess we're, the Santa Fe still existed. Wow, we're triggering trains and uh, we haven't even left the station yet. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, there's a uh, Santa Fe F7. Yeah. So, yeah, that reminds me. Uh, once again, I have done my best to install all of the uh, of the layers. Uh, so, we're not just going to see Metrolink trains. We're going to see everything. We're going to see BNSF trains, the Pacific trains, and your mother trains. He didn't actually really buy it. Indeed. I tore it today because I'm not going to buy anything. Well, technically, I did. I actually bought this game, which gave me this raw, which I didn't really want to pay for, but... I'm going to buy everything. Oh, I... Well, I guess since we're still here, I might as well take a look around the uh, LA Union Station. Oh, we have a tram line here. Look at this. All right, I want to go on That's this. Yeah. I guess it goes the other way. Well, That's pretty cool. Uh -huh. And yeah, welcome to Los Angeles. Actually, am I allowed to go through here? No, wait for the signal to change. Well, I guess what we're doing then, let's take a look at the whole route map. Oh, let's go going north. Look at that. 80 miles of trackage. That we're going to be driving over today. Oh, it's right, this, this engine number 911. Yay, it's her Twin Tower joke here. here. 
Oh, that's just perfect. Okay, well, it looks like this the uh, the map isn't available, which... Okay. Alright, well, it looks like we're stuck here at this red light, so we might as well just sit here and wait until it turns green. Hey, it looks like our first up is Glendale. So yeah, long journey ahead of us indeed. Oh, there's a huge gap. Time towards the end, I just noticed. All right. Uh, so the service move for today is the AV213 from LA Union to Lancaster. So this is a full service, which goes the entire route. Although all these are actually full service, including the entire route. Although some of these are like parts, but this service is the full bang. Alright. So while we had a red light then, what were we waiting for? Um Oh, is it this guy? Wait, but he's on the other track. <laughs> Russell <laughs> Why is there a train in front? <laughs> I'm totally not out of out of the train. Russell, I'm not going back into the train because that cloud is. Russell, oh yeah, we also have special guests here, Mr. Bubbles. Hello, I'm gonna be on this train today. Just waiting for no, this guy. Boy, I'm gonna be on the train too. No. And there's another train, I guess, we're waiting for him to pull into the station. I hope this remote was going to be the Look at that LA skyline, it looks pretty cool. I said, I hope this remote was going to be the what he did during that spot show. Yeah, mother! Alright, let's see what the F7s are up to. No, I guess they're just chilling. Hey, train, go faster. Yeah, mother! Oh, but yeah, I have gotten all the uh, layers I could get, so that is the uh, Con Pass, BSC 70 ACE, uh, BNSF version, uh, also got Sherman Hill, the Union Pacific Heritage Collection Pack, as well as the Santa Fe F7. And I think that's all of them. Might be another one I forgot about, but okay. yeah. What? Right. Our, uh, our engine number is 911. Indeed it is. That's the number that we're going to be calling by the end of this journey when everyone is game been game ended. What? Ha uh ha. -huh. Okay, you, get out of the way. It's the luxurious hospital train. Ha uh -huh. Yeah, I don't know why this guy's going so slow. It's a union station. What do you expect? Hey, but he's on my track. Oh, it's turning over. Okay. Okay, so as soon as he passes, we're gonna be able to get the all clear. So you, Mr. Train, get a move on. I keep seeing it with me, Froggy. Now, yeah, stupid. Yay, we get the green! Alright, let's go. We haven't even left yet. Oh, now we are. All right, finally the green light has been been cleared. Our line is go, so we're gonna go. Yeah. I'm leaving. You just got your stupid. Ah. Uh -huh. Also, this thing even has a new e bell recording, which is nice, better than the generic e bell that would get on everything else. Is it accurate? I don't know. I've never heard these things in real life. It sounds good, though. All right, so after all that, we are finally leaving LA Union Station, bound for Lancaster. Also, the sound thing should be accurate because according to Dovetail, they actually went out to California and made sure to get all the sounds recorded for this simulation. So the sounds should be as accurate as possible. 
And, uh, I mean, from what I can tell, at least, yeah, that sounds pretty good, although I haven't actually heard these things in real life, so I don't, I don't know how, how to compare. So if there's any, uh, Metrolink, uh, gurus watching this stream, uh, or watching it in post, uh, let me know if the sounds are good or not. No. He just wants your money. Ha, 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 ha. Which he's never getting a cent out of. Ha, ha, ha. And why are we going so slow? We're only going 12 miles per hour. This is the stop in terminal. Oh, that's right. I forgot we were exiting a terminal station. Let's move the microphone back a little bit. One thing I've actually noticed about the F-125 as well is that the, uh, there's these, this, this, there's this, like, electric sound, so I think this engine is also a hybrid, I think. I'm not sure. Okay, and I'm going slightly over the speed limit, but we're also going slow, so yeah. Alright, so we're four and a half miles away, or, four, yeah, four point seven miles away from our other first stop, which is Glendale. There we go, now we can accelerate. Yeah, and your electric noise is so... Hmm. Hey, Jeffrey, you are so slow. Yeah, I'm mother! I am very strong. Way stronger than you'll ever be. Uh-huh. At least I'm not a forgotten zero piece. At least, at least I don't uh -huh. need them because everyone can forget your name. Uh -huh. You do realize Sodor is a main place too, right? And? The engine's on the island of Solus. We're here to trigger Russell. Also, yeah, this is the thing of a horn sequencer. Huh. Wait, does it have a horn sequencer button? The cab car does. Oh, it does! Hey! Oh, it doesn't work. The horn sequencer button is for is for lazy people. Oh, okay. So this this engine does actually have a horn sequencer button, but it's broken. Well done, Dovetail I'm Games. I'm gonna break it. Awesome. Anyway, because yeah, I was actually test driving the uh, the cab car earlier today, and that one does have a horn sequencer, which does in fact work, but it doesn't work on this thing for some reason. All right, so just for time now, we're just going through the city of uh, of Los Angeles. Yeah. Oh, now it works. That is a terrible delay. So far, the experience I wish we weren't dealing by that stupid. Shut up, Vorn! Oh, so the horn sequencer does does work, but it takes forever to come on. Hey, let's try it again. Robbie, you're gonna wake up murder. Okay, no, I guess it only seems to work whenever it feels like it. Okay. Also, Russell, we we have we barely exited the LA yet, so we can't give a proper review on this thing just yet. Stupid. You're gonna wake up murder. Yeah, well, uh, we can afford to do that for today. I also guess the taillights on the cap car are broken. Yep, there it goes again. Okay, so I guess the horn sequencer does kind of work, but it takes forever to come on. That is... Is that realistic, or is that just dovetail being dovetail? Oh, there's some trees parked in the yard. A lot of metro than gizms. <clears throat> uh. 
All right, so we're on the road. Nothing exploded yet. Let's have a good trip. Yeah. Okay, Russell. <laughs> yes, Frowny, I promise to behave myself. Good boy. I. Also, yeah, we're driving with dynamic weather off, by the way, so yeah, we're not gonna have, like, well, the weather changing wildly or something. Which is good, because, uh, yeah, the dynamic weather in this game, yeah, it's... I have, I haven't driven with dynamic weather on in a while, but I don't really want to. Yes, Russell? No speeding on this game, you know, tell Andrew about you. Yeah, Russell, no speeding! Uh, is there some background noise in Ryan's place? Yeah, blah. Alright, joint sounds. Oh. Alright, Russell, no muting. You owe me money. Haha. Uh -huh. Ooh, 79 miles per hour. All right. We're going to be able to get some serious speed soon. Well, I said that we do have the Glendale stop coming up, but after that. Whoops. Well, I will say the LA part of this road looks interesting. Not a lot of traffic, though. Stop looking at me, Mr. Bubbles. I gotta make sure you don't do anything stupid! Alright, there's some, uh, BSF, uh, thingy cars, though. Yeah. Ugh. Special, special. There we go, a bit more power. I was gonna stop. Yeah, mala. Hey, we're now arriving at Glendale. Come on. There we go. Oh, we're right, right on time. Oh, come on. And here we are, first stop of the day. Looks like we have a train of uh, empty container cars sitting here. And a lot of ambient noise here as well. Mm, look at these coaches. You better not bang them. I don't think we have a quick stop here. And 
Huh, next up is already here. Or, not here, but close. Burbank. Hey, Rosa, you ready to go to the bank? We're totally not gonna rob it. Yeah. No oh. money for you. Yeah, mala. Shut up, Jeffrey. Uh-huh. I'm not the one who got killed by the jet train. Uh-huh. Also, viewers, I do apologize if the screen flashes black, black for a little bit. That's just me switching between windows and everything. Yeah, train people does that because it's stupid. I don't have Sophie. It looks like the jet train can you back. Uh-huh. All right, let's see if we can reach 79. Well, yeah, let's see, we have all new recordings on this thing, which is good. So they can bother to record new sounds for the Vectron and this, but not the Talent 1. For some reason. Also, we have a yellow. Russell, why do we have a yellow? Ah, oh, it's just for the station. Okay, I guess the uh, signals are very far apart from each other on this uh, part of the line. Yeah, we are moving. Oh. Uh oh. Oh. Yeah, I don't know what's up with these freeze issues and everything. Huh. So let's go to the free room. Switch so between free room camera and. Thing. Oh, that doesn't result in a crash. Also, the uh, E bell kind of reminds me of the uh, MBTA E bells. Grade crossings! Quiet zones. I don't know if they're noisy zones or quiet zones. You're going like a murder. Wait. Oh. Huh, and they have good, um, uh, good, uh, crossing sound recordings as well. Nice. All right, well, it seems that like we're getting into the more... Well, okay, we're not quite in the countryside yet, we are, but we're definitely leaving the, uh... the most dense parts of the city. I've never actually been to L.A. So, yeah. Actually, I've never been to the West Coast in general, so... I don't know the geography of it that well. All right, about to come up on Burbank. Bank coaches. I'm gonna bank some coaches into Ted. Uh huh. Yeah, a lot of stuttering because. Uh. Cause dovetail. So Burbank downtown is where we're arriving at now. Hmm, I just got here. Bit far ahead of schedule.
Hmm, breaks are very responsive. Like the uh, talent. Alright, Burbank something. Wait, is there a sound? Or sound? Is there a uh, name board here? No. Also, I may have lied about leaving the city parts of LA because it's still pretty loud according to what the game did, I think. Yep. Yeah, there's also a bus terminal here. Next to Baltimore the buses. That's rare. Hmm. Dovetail actually did a decent job with an American add-on? Wow, that's rare. There's a helicopter somewhere. But I can't see it. But yeah, according to Delta, I guess LA is very noisy. I was gonna say I actually quite like the way the Zoko looks, you know, it's it's a different sort of American diesel that we get. You know, most of the American diesels that we have here in Transformers are just freight or or older passenger engines. So it's just something a bit more modern for once. As yeah, according to the uh, tutorial, this was built in twenty seventeen. So it's actually pretty recent uh, locomotive on Metrolink's roster. Alright. And I'm about to pull away for the next stop. Hmm, only two miles to Burbank Airport. And let's just go down to thirty five and then back up to fifty. Oh, it's changing track. Huh. Not sure why, but okay. And back up to 50. So a lot of pretty close stops to start off. This journey. Keep in mind, this route is uh, 80 miles long. I'm going to have to try not to get into the free room camera too much because, you know, if the game crashes, then we're all doomed. Wow. Oh, this part looks kind of bad. Yeah, these flat tires here look pretty bad. I don't know why they why they thought this was acceptable. I said I'm not nothing. Dovetail games and Russell. You've both caused confusion and delay. Stupid, stupid Dovetail always uh -huh. thinks he's better. Hey Russell. No. The Amazon controller was very cross. Russell, you're broken everything. You have yet to watch the other content. 
Haha. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, we accept up to 60, but uh, except we're already approaching the next station. So Burbank Airport. Ooh, I wonder if we're gonna see any planes. Okay. Oh, we're about to go into single track. Ah. Wow, no single track line exists. That's surprising. And we're quite a ways out of schedule as well, so no pressure on, uh, on, um, on fish. Uh. Hmm, pretty short platform as well. Hmm, so this you know is World Bank Airport. You know something, Erica? I ship Bread Machine and Dovetail Games because they are both utterly stupid. Ha, uh, ha. Uh. They're stupid. You're stupider. In fact, I think you're so stupid you should go to Jupiter. Ah. Uh, uh. I will turn you around. I guess we'll walk outside the engine a little bit since there's a. Uh, and I will turn you here. into rust. Ah. Uh -huh. Is that what you are already? Oh, it was an RV. You got more rust on you than me. Ah. Uh -huh. Okay, we'll get to the road. We can! Oh, but okay, actually, on the road. Why are they going so slow? Wait. I can make the car stop. Wait, what? Wait, the cars stop when you walk up to them? Huh. Well, that's new. Didn't know that was possible here in Train Sim World. Also, where's the airport? Uh. Russell? Yeah, I guess if you get close enough to the vehicles, they come to a stop. That's pretty cool. You're causing a lot of traffic jams. Ah. Uh -huh. Yeah, Jeffrey is because he's too big and fat. Just like I'm you. Oh, Metro like better. Even a tram engine. Hey. Metro, you thank you for 30 years. Yeah. Oh, another one? Oh, route map. Where's this at? I'm gonna have Gabe oh, here we crash are. you crash for your shed. Oh yeah, and they also have realistic route maps as well, which is new. So yeah, there's uh before he does that, yeah. I'm gonna push you to your shed. So there's say there's a couple of little lines. We also there's have a giant ditch behind uh we also have LA Union Station and then there Oh hey, passengers! There's LA Union Station where we came from, there's Glendale, Burbank, and then there is Burbank Airport Road, which is where we're at right now. And then I guess we have a short hop over to Sun Valley. And then, uh, I think all the seats are a bit further apart. Hey, Mr. Bulls, I will use the bathroom. You better be quack! Yeah, I'm gonna plug the toilet so that you can't use it. Yeah, ma! Yeah, bread machine, scram. Uh huh. Hey, let's see if I can run to the cab and, uh, and actually find where this airport is. I'll steal all your coal. I will destroy your pantographs if you do. Uh -huh. Wait, I thought you were an orphan. But Jeffrey wasn't listening. Alright, where's this airport? It's hundreds of miles of. Oh, wait, it's over there. Oh. Oh, there's the airport hangar. Oh, there's the airport. Huh. Pretty badly detailed, but it's there, like, I guess. Also, we're now on single track. Is this a reference to Microsoft Flight Sim? I guess it is. Alright, about to depart. Yeah, I'm gonna fly a 7 to Crony's house. I'm gonna fly a 737 into Russell's house.
All right. Oh, we're rolling. Why are you rolling and backwards? You wrote Jeffrey Tender. Huh. I guess that's why they want you to put on the brake and then fly by the throttle. All right. Next stop, Sun Valley. Hmm. I wonder that's. I wonder if that's a reference to Shen Valley. From the hit era. I will crash the Hindenburg into Ted's shed. Ha uh ha. -huh. You wouldn't dare. Now, oh, hey, Russell. No. Shen Valley reference. No. Ha 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 ha! What's next? Ted of the Whistling Woods? Yeah, I can't wait until I make that episode. I will push Ted down Shen Valley. Because he is the stupidest bread machine I ever met. Uh -huh. I will take you with me. Good luck. I can break your coupler. Anyway, so it looks like now we actually have a pretty close trip to Shen, Shen Valley. Idle. And then a bit of, then, then bit of a drive, but not too long a drive, to Selmar San Fernando. Fernando Alonso. And then actually a bit of a drive to uh, Newhall. Yay. Oh, this, this is definitely a big world, big adventure! Yeah! Give me a train. No! You're gonna be on this train for always and always and always. Okay, so I'm back on the photo and I'll pull the brakes because we're already approaching the next stop of Shen Valley. No! Ha ha! Ryan. Ah. Also, speaking of planes, this train makes a strange like sound when when the I think the dynamic brakes apply. I like, guess one interesting thing about this train is that it does have a dynamic brake, uh, but said dynamic brake is used by the uh, combined brake and throttle, which is interesting. Uh oh, stop! There we go. And here we are. One, two, uh huh. All right, over at the next stop of Shen Valley. What did you say, Red Machine? Uh -huh. I said you are colorblind. Ah, oh, we still have such a long way to go. You are more colorblind than me. I remember the time where you mistaken a red signal for a green one. Ha uh ha. -huh. About Frody. No, that was you! Get out of here, Mr. Toothbrush. Yeah, ma! Metrolink. I also like this painting. This wave design is actually pretty cool. That's pretty cool in general that we finally Bobby. have better look at Trades in World. Yes, Russell? So far, I'm enjoying the experience, although I wish for a double track. Uh huh. Alright, closing the doors. Please stand clear of the door. Uh -huh. More like stand clear of bread machine. Jeffrey, get out of the live stream! Uh huh. I'll get out once you get scrapped. I am Ryan on the stream. Uh -huh. Anyway, next stop, Selmar San Fernando. Hey, Jeffrey, you do realize Ryan's on the stream, right? Yeah. Yeah, Mala. And he's gonna help me push you down the gulag. Uh huh. Also, it looks like we're getting back into a double track territory, although we're on and the wrong track. Oh, wait, it's just a uh, siding. Never mind. I was about to say that we're wrong roading. What was that bread machine? Oh, never mind. I didn't care if I heard you or not because you are an you are an idiot. Uh huh. Brody, shut up. You're Look at this engine. Yeah. Brody, shut up. You're about to be retired too. Oh. 
Actually, I might get a life extension because the failures are still broken. <laughs> no. I had, I had a reason to uh -huh. be preserved. So did we. Barely. I was selected for preservation from the start. Uh -huh. Unfortunately, they chose to save you. Oh, so those are the brake discs. That's because I was in some of the best conditions out of the rest of the engines. Well, what about stupid? Robert. Stupid! We're all in good condition, but you were the worst. But stupid has a crack in his boiler. Also, one thing I've noticed about the, uh, the Rotom coaches but is that the brake discs are on the... Shut up! And one thing I noticed about the Rotom coach is that the brake discs are actually on the outside of the wheels rather than inside, like on most trains. I wonder why they do that. Because they can. Ah. Uh, I don't know, we're 79 miles per hour! Yay! Fastest speed we're probably gonna go today. Let's get a flyby. Ooh, we got a grade crossing flyby. Yes! We're gonna blow the horn. Uh, are you sure? Because. Uh huh. Really Aren't you? Murder, Frody's blowing the horn. Yo, Mama! Anyways, my horn is the best sounding, unlike Jeffrey. Not really. See, even Frowny knows I have the best whistle in the world. Ear, fear, say. I just realized all the cars stopped when I got there. <laughs> My whistle didn't age as much as your stupid, ugly horn. Uh huh. Well, I'm Oh, stuttering. So the um, anti-violent, it's interesting so far, but not a lot of traffic, so yeah, you're not going to see very much. Uh -huh. I would have thought we've seen a, at least one friction by now, but no. Nah. Come on, game. Good. Wow. Ooh, an ad break. Just in time for me to throw bread machine off the train. Uh huh. Now we're back. Hey, so go back up 79. Oh, it's going back up 60, though. Also, why are there all these yellows? Russell. Also, is most of this line just single track? Wow. No wonder the surface on this line is so infrequent. There's barely any trains on it because the it's all single track. I mean, this area is not as busy. Yeah, I guess so. Okay, let's... Oh, come on. Oh, please don't crash. Okay. <laughs> yeah, every time the game freezes up, I would be afraid. Oh, it's gonna crash? Because that's really bad, actually. Also, come on. I, it didn't start this badly in Trains in Rule 3, so they actually made the optimization worse. Ah... <sighs> That's our dovetail. Oh, I gotta slow down the next station. All right, Selmar San Fernando. No, oh, bring your toys.
Oh, this station looks interesting. Oh, yeah, another brick's a little bit too late. <clears throat> okay, but yeah, luckily the brakes this thing are very responsive. Like, you release the brake, and they come off pretty quickly. Oh my- Stop freezing, game! Ah, <sighs> this is why you don't rush things to meet a deadline. Yeah, three, two, one, three. Oh, hey, yeah, this is the, uh, this is accurate, I think, or, I don't know. I said July 4th, oh, it's disappeared. Oh, yeah, I forgot, I set the date for July 4th, I mainly mean, did that because I wanted to do, like, a midsummer day so we get the maximum assembly, but also, we're playing the July 4th on American Row, yay! I was the uh, somewhere for four cars apparently. Interesting. And yeah, we do need to have four cars. Is this like the same metro length length or something? I thought. Yeah. Mm, I don't know. I, I guess four cars is like the standard length for this line. What was that bread machine? Ah. Uh. Boss. I ask you, toothbrush. All right. And close the doors. Come on, doors. Thank you. Alright, next stop. Oh. Why are we rolling backwards? Okay, let's buy a bit of power. And then release the brake. Ah. Okay, so, yeah, so I guess when you're doing an incline start, you want to have the brake on just a little bit, apply a bit of power, and then release the brake. Alright, full power. So that, my friends, is how to start a train on an incline. And now everyone's yelling. Ah. Alright, so next up, New Hall. But it looks like most of this line is single track, which is actually quite rare for trains in the world. We don't usually get single track main line routes. Except the consequence of that is that there's barely any trains you see. So, um, yeah. It's not the most exciting route in terms of rail traffic. <clears throat> Hmm. Also, apparently this road is supposed to run through Hollywood. Hmm. Hollywood? More like Bollywood. Uh-huh. So I wonder when we'll see that on this route. Ryan. Yes. Right. What? What's my phone doing? She's sitting on my footplate. While you watch this stream. Yeah. Ah. Uh -huh. And Jeffrey's there man. too. Also, hey, is that was served up. Hello there, um, Mr. Team. Same as Trains World Three. Actually, it's worse than Trains in World Three because there's optimization issues now. It freezes up sometimes. <laughs> Oh. Uh huh. Yeah, I've definitely noticed a significant more amount of stuttering in this game compared to Trains in World Three. So, as our dovetail, they actually made the optimization worse. Yeah, I'm getting big, big lag stutters whenever it's loading in like a bunch of scenery and stuff in the distance. Oh my god. Uh huh.
Also, hey, we're on the double track section. Oh, but it's exciting. Finally. Haha. Uh -huh. However, it's only a short one. Hey, Brian. Huh? I see you something on Instagram. Uh -huh. Ted loves Kobe, Miho loves Doug. Well, secretly. Yeah. Alright, oh, so it's number 45, so I'm swearing for nothing. Why would you make a 60 ball per hour section so short between two 45s? That's uh. stupid! <laughs> Russell! Did you build this route? <laughs> you will die. So what, go on the phone and set up to 60, but no, I have to slow down again. Oh, and they have to go down to 35! Why? Well, I hope you enjoyed going fast, because now we're going to go slow. No. And... I, I don't like going slow. Oops. No speeding. Well, I mean, Jeffrey is slow. Uh-huh. That means I'm following the speed. Not really. You actually go. You're actually going at top speed. My top speed is the speed limit. If you go at yours, you derail in just a millisecond. That strange. That's like a weird plane sound for some reason. My top speed is the same as Darsh's. Yeah. What? This one good Darsh, two hundred twenty-five miles per hour. FEFs go about a, over a hundred. Hang on, I think one went faster than the Mallard at one point in train sim. That's Dimec. Uh-huh. FDFs were built for that. It's either Laser Jet or me that made Dimec go so fast. Hey Ryan, can you make a, a, a Dimec in your morning mean <laughs> I'll find the time. It should be easy to make, right? Yeah, that's true. So that whenever he this is career morning meeting. Bridge. Bridge are going under apparently. Oh, the camera needs to go up that high because of course it doesn't. Well, yeah, I guess not much rail traffic goes through here, so that's why it's only single track. Hmm. I wonder what it'll be like to drive a freight train on this route. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna do it later, but... Well, not later in the stream, but later in my casual time, but yeah. Uh, but wow, we're going slow. I like going slow. Yeah, mama. Yeah, much slower than me. Would you shut up, Jeffrey? I'll shut up when you scram. Yeah, I'll scram after I scram this plug, plug up you. You're a scam to the stream. I'm gonna shove a plug up. Hi, children. Also, oh, we're about to enter a tunnel. Yeah, Jeffrey, respect the children. Uh huh. You're a child. Your wife is a child. And we're going through a tunnel! Yay! We'll be stuck in that tunnel. Yeah, you. I'll wall you up in the tunnel before I get caught. Uh, You'll be uh. left in there for always and always and always. Then you can't have to worry about me at all. Yeah, you'll get a balloon stuck in the tunnel. Hey, that's reference to my favorite episode. Up, up, and away. 
I'll put I'll put Mr. Snowman in the tunnel with you. Have fun kissing him. Uh huh. Wow, what's the glow on the microphone at the uh, at the up up and away reference? I mean, my God, Russell always blows on the microphone whenever I mention Sharon Miller episodes. You idiot! I'm I'm preserving my voice, although Jeffrey's not helping for, at all. For what? For the yelling later after uh. when you pass a red signal. Also, why are we going so slow through this tunnel? It's straight. This route is boring. Uh huh. <laughs> You're boring. Speaking of which, yeah, I thought the Broberg line wasn't really that fun, but yeah, this is just uh, it's basically Ryan driving isn't slow. Even saying anything. Uh huh. Because Ryan. I'm talking with my wife. Uh huh. Oh. And also, we still have an hour and a half to go left in this journey. <laughs> also, it was supposed to be me, Ryan, and Frody, not Jeffrey, because he wasn't invited. Uh-huh. What? You weren't invited to the stream. Well, Ryan told me it was going to happen, so I decided to pop in and see what's going on. Until I found out that you were part of it. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Ah, let's got some water. Don't make me go over there. Yeah, I'll push you off the cliff just like Mark. You will not destroy my laptop. But well, he already will. did. So and well, yay! We're Frony. finally out of the tunnel! Yay! You could destroy Frownie's supercomputer. Hey, Russell, look, it's bright again! My eyes. Uh -huh. There we go, up to forty. I've noticed there are a lot of freight sightings, though. That's because this is a commuter line. <laughs> stupid. You're stupid. Stupid, stupid bread machine. Oh, come on, dynamic oh, break. There we go. He's a genius. Whoa, the dynamic break in this train actually works. That's cool. I hope Jeffrey's positive train control system fails. Uh huh. Yeah, because um, I remember actually, I remember. I think the last year when the Con Pass was a new route, I tried to to drive that with the uh, uh, the uh, dynamic brake, and it didn't work half the time. Fortunately, though, this train does have a working dynamic brake that I can actually use and slow the train down, but not too much to where I'm actually traveling at the speed limit. I hate Jeffrey. Yeah. I hate Jeffrey. I hate Jeffrey. And that, my friends, I is why I don't like driving machine, freight trains. I hate brake machine. I hate ten. I hate ten. I hate ten. Uh huh. Yay! Grade crossing! Ooh. A nun. Why is a murder nun so? I will push Ted through the station. I'm going to mute Jeffrey. Oh! You don't have the power, so Nana boo boo on you. Oz, can I say the dynamic brake is the greatest feature ever on a train? Well, one of the greatest features ever on a train. Who are you? He says. Russell. What? Dynamic brake isms. Can't you see I'm trying to uh, insult Jeffrey? You're doing a terrible job at it. So are you. Yeah, mala. Who knew Bread Machine can be this bad at roasting me? Uh-huh. Why are you insulting me when you can't insult Crowney instead? I have better jokes to use against you than him. Besides, I don't need, I don't care about him. Anyway, we're about to arrive in care. New Hall! Yay! A stance! You don't care about the fellas. And we're going so I slow! Hardly see those, I hardly see those toothbrushes in my life. 
Only yeah, man. Face. Anyway, face now arriving at New Hall. Your face looks squashed. Breaks. Yeah, because of you. Russell! You better slow down in time. Uh oh. Stop! I told you to overshoot the platform. Brody, I'm not the one driving with the maid. Russell, you idiot! We overshot the platform! That's your fault. That's what happens when you just don't, don't stop bickering all the time. Now we gotta go back. Blame Jeffrey. Ladies and gentlemen, we do apologize for the station overrun. A couple of our passengers are very noisy today. Yeah, Jeffrey. You started it. No, you just happened to show up, did you? Was it necessary for you to comment? I'll only ruin the stream if you say anything about me. Uh-huh. It was more peaceful when Ryan was just here, but no, you just happened to roll in. Door! Oh, uh, door's closed. Alright, welcome to, uh, what was station again? Whitehall? New Hall. <laughs> I don't know where I got Whitehall from. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, we once again apologize for ever seeing the station. Russell's an idiot. And he owes me money. Jeffrey. Hey, look, this seat decided to open up the window. Oh, he's even got our uh, service thing. 313, Gene to Lancaster. Nice. All right, next up, Santa Clarita. It's only two and a half miles away, or two point two. It's got a lot of seats next to it, a whole half hour. Do do do. Is interesting. More whack in your face. Hmm. At least I'm strong, and you're not. Also, we haven't seen a single other train since we left LA. Yeah, because Jeffrey scared him away. Uh huh. I didn't know this line was so, uh. uh boring. Single. Right? Indeed. Single. Just like you! You as well, stupid. Oh. At least it's not a bad word, right? Oh. We don't need to get demonetized by Susan Wing Wang. Oh, I'll, I'll find a way one day. I'll make Susan Wing Wang game and Ted. Uh huh. Okay, come but on, break. I do that. Be sure to check out my fiber disk. Think of it as a, uh, yeah, you can pay me and I'll make you a video. I'm not giving you any of my money. Yeah, mala. I can do those myself. Not, I can do those myself. Will be better, said Jeffrey. Yeah, mala. Train. Even Dry not it enjoying his stuff now thanks to you. Okay, then I break. Jeffrey wasn't listening. Oh, we have yeah. a 39th limit right. coming up. Also, yeah. 39, that's a weird number. And power. Well, you want to go on this line? Uh huh. Let's. I'll find a time to go on wherever this place is. I'm sure it's very peaceful here. But mind you, it may be really, really hot. Wait, what? 
Indeed. Where does she want to go? Ryan. Wherever this route is. Oh, California? Yeah. yeah. She wants to go to California. Yay! Oh, I gotta slow down! Yeah, these fields really come up on you, don't they? Eh, it's, it's fine. It's full of liberals. What? It's full of liberals. Uh huh. Mm. Eh, we're just on a 39 for this. Come on. I'll bring her Tiger 1 then. Before I go to California, I need to marshal myself onto a freight train to prevent a light engine move. You mean a fairy move? Uh, yeah. Fairies? Oh no. Oh no, I should say that about bread machine, said Jeffrey. Uh -huh. You're not going to California, Jeffrey. Erica wanted to go too. No, Alright, where are we? Yeah, she does. She, she can't afford it. it. Oh, hey, we're about a third of the way through the route, I think. she rides on me, right, Erica? See? And we're about to go back to the single track section. Why is the camera going weird? Russell? <laughs> we're like an invisible... Oh, there we go. Alright, power! I swear I'm going to lose right. my voice at the end of the night. Uh-huh. We. We are stupid. We're next to more Come mountains. On. We're like so slow. Yeah, Jeffrey's a perfect mountain engine. Yes, I can climb mountains unlike you. Also, oh, can I? I can climb the hill up for Philadelphia Station. Oh, really? Try the grades of Sherman Hill. I've climbed those for many, many years. Uh-huh. I'm sure Darsh has too. Hey, they're about some trains in Wilt. Well, and... not with a freight train. Oh, come on. Hey, now we got Santa Clarita. You're just... You're just mad because he goes faster than you. Okay, this time, let's not oversee the platform, Russell. Glad you say. Why don't you try pulling 120 loaded boxcars up Sherman Hill? You think you can do that? But Dad didn't listen. He was too stupid. He was too scared to admit how oh, weak he come was. On. And... Nailed it! Greatest train driver in the world. Not really. Even the greatest train driver in the world is stronger than Bread Machine. Uh huh. And welcome to uh, Santa Clarita, I guess. You are pushing it, Jeffrey. <laughs> what? Look at these. There's like old TVs or something. Wait, Dovetail Times? Just want to dovetail have their own uh, newspaper. What about the LA Times? Yeah. This is in Los Angeles, after all. That's weird. Oh, there's a hot dog stand! Ooh, I like that. Yeah. And some pretzels. Lizzie's. Daily Dog Tell News. Uh, hey, Russell, do you want a hot dog while we're here? I'm not even hungry. Yo, mala! I'll put some hot dogs in Ted's traction mm. motors. Well, we'll say at least this station is pretty well detailed. Very. I'll, I'll squirt hot oh, mustard it? On, in Erica's Hey, Wallace, well, did you lose your cowboy hat? Uh, no. Because I found one that's just laying does around. Texas on it? Maybe it does. I'll squirt hot mustard in Erica's eyes. I'll pour some magma. Oh, I'll this passage lost his way. Oi! Yeah, there you go. That's what I thought. Get in my train, which is being helmed by the greatest train driver in the world.
All right. Um. Okay, apparently next up is called Via Princessa, which is interesting. Oh, hang on. It's called Via Princessa. By the way, does it want us to stop there or not stop there? That's the question. Oh, these things are a lot closer to them than I thought. Oh. Yep. Okay, and this minute goes back up to 70, so yay! Side speed is on the side. We're almost at the halfway point, actually. I would say this definitely feels like a journey. It's a very important service. Yes, indeed! I can't wait to get to Lancaster so I can do my cloud jewels! Indeed, Mr. Bubbles. What? No. Bad behavior. Red machine has bad behavior. Ah. Uh -huh. At least I don't say the F. Oi! Just said it. You say it all the time! You, you need to shut up. And you better not say it today, because if we get demonetized, then you're going to get no money. I don't want your money. But secretly, he did. Because he was in debt. Ah. Uh -huh. But yeah, I have to say, this route has a lot more uh, single track sections than I expected it to. I was expecting it to at least be a somewhat busy mainline, but nah, it's just single track. Which, uh, I mean, if you like single track lines, then I mean, hey, this is a pretty decent route. But uh, if you like a more busy route, uh, you'll want to skip out on this one. I'll probably do a couple more, a uh, couple freight services, and maybe some of the two-part services. But then after that, uh, yeah, it's gonna have the same fate as the uh, Broberg line. It's not for Frony till Bobbin. So I guess we'll see if the uh, East Coast Milan is any better tomorrow. See which. Hey Russell, what are you doing tomorrow? Uh. Big World Adventure. Are you gonna be done in Why? time? Because we have another show Why? tomorrow. I didn't do one today because we were doing a stream. Well, we might be doing another one tomorrow, and tomorrow we're gonna be driving British trains, including the Flying Sausage. You mean Great Trains, brother? Yes. So. I recommend you show up to that one. I'm more looking forward to seeing him than Bread Machine. Ah. Uh -huh. He does slow down? like calendars. You mean doesn't know? Don't judge someone's opinion before you get to know them, little. I was supposed to have some past. Oh, it's handle off. Okay. Okay, it's... not at least the brakes. Welcome to Via Princesa. 
Russell is a princess. Yeah, he is. Uh huh. So Ryan, what do you think of the experience right now? The environment, the landscape looks pretty relaxing. I must say, I'll definitely go here tomorrow. Wait, what? I am bringing You're my wife with right me. Now. Oh yeah. You're not even in America. Bob. What is that? I'll be taking a ship to America. Oh, it's in trucks. Huh. Well, tomorrow we're gonna be off to the UK. So, hey, Russell. No. Can you finish your big old big adventure in time for the show? Oh, yo, 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 yo. Actually, Russell. Why are we? Why are we looking at trucks? I don't know. I just saw them on the highway. I was like, "Ooh, that looks interesting." Lori. Also, there's a little, like, five-second delay in the stream. Uh huh. Pipes. Compared to real time. Also, these coaches are not that bad. I I wish there was like more shine to them. Uh huh. And we are There's now to be MBT coaches, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, Hyundai Bernie... Rotom also builds double decker coaches for the MBTA. Bernie Bernie. Bernie. Although these particular coaches wouldn't work on MBTA because these coaches are only low level and MBTA these low level and high level compatible coaches. All right, uh, Vista Canyon is up next. Another stuff that's pretty close. Okay, so the trick is to apply a little bit of power. Well, set the brake to minimum, apply a bit of power, and then release the brake, and that's how to start on an incline without lurching Bernie. backwards. Wham! First afraid spur in front of you. Yay! Too bad there's no freight trains in here, but yay! It took me that long to notice. I, I, Yamala. So Vista Canyon, that's pretty close. And then, um, and then a half an hour to go to the next up, which is, uh, Fancy Great. Actually, hey, we don't have that many stops left as well. Nice. So Vista Canyon, and then a long distance between the next few stops. Nice. So hey, I'll get a nice break from having to stop at a station. Anyway, yes, Russell? I'm going to steal something. Fine! I was going to slow down. Nope, then I have a break. I don't need that. I have already told Mika <coughs> that the machine is on his way. And I told her exactly what to take from him. Stop! Wait, why are we she going... my horn yesterday. Wait, we're going this way? And she's going to do it again. Oh! I think we're about to enter some double track portions! Yay! And, but first, we're in a very strange route. This is the most bland, blind page out. Uh huh. You know, all things considered, well, I think what happened was that Dovetail wanted to make a Metrolink route. So they went to Metrolink and they asked and say, hey, what's what route should we make in Train Sim World? And the Metrolink were like, hey, you should do the Into the Body Line. Which, I mean, I guess isn't the worst choice, but at the same time... It's kind of dull. Yeah. In terms of track. Scenery's all right. Also, this part's weird. Like, Ryan. Yeah. Anyway, um... Oh. Oh my god, and there's another train coming! Wow, I thought we were the only soul in the whole world. Oh, this is probably interesting. Uh huh. And why are we going so slow? Because this is a fast track. Yamala! This route is allergic to bread machine. Uh-huh. 
I can't even go on this route unless Darsh takes me here. Ah, ah. Good, I'll tell him not to. Well, at least the route that we'll be going tomorrow will be very Ted friendly. As hey, Ted actually worked there at one point. So, hey Russell, can you finish up your bubble before the stream tomorrow? Probably never. Russell? Because tomorrow we're off to the East Coast mainline where we're gonna meet the flying sausage. Hey, sausage. Ah. Come on, power! Yeah. As we're just strolling along the line to Vista Canyon. Ah, where does Vista? Wait, what? This thing is called Vista Canyon. Vista? No, not Windows Vista! The worst operating system ever! That's what Jeffrey is. He's, uh, he's Windows Vista. Also, why are we going so slow? We can go faster than this through here. Come on. Also, look, it's another train! Wow! Metro, another Metro Lake train exists. Yay! Also, I think this is actually a station that doesn't actually exist yet in real life. Oh my god. Indeed. It's another tray. We're not the only one in the world. Yay. Look at this mind chilling. We're going, we're going so slow. Why is, wait, why is speed only 25 through here? That's, it's, yeah, it's slow. All right. Welcome to Windows Vista Canyon. Yay, Windows Vista. No! <laughs> Windows Vista is the Penn Central of operating systems. What's next? Penn, Penn Central Station. No! Jeffrey, if you don't shut up, I'm going to pay you to the Chesapeake in Ohio. You dare do that, uh -huh. and you won't want to know what I'll do to you. Also, apparently we're a little bit late. That's uh, your so, fault. Yours. So yeah, Windows Vista Canyon. It actually kind of looks like Windows Vista, or at least the station does. Oh. Is this really supposed to be reference to Windows Vista? Metro Link! Also, what are these black thingies? Boss. Right, we're running late. All right, Paz, get on board. We gotta go. Jeffrey has a three charge steam whistle. Ah! Okay, bit of power. Three chain hands. The brakes. Like. Yay. All right. Well, at least now we have a wall to go. So, 90 miles to Vincent Grade Acton. Yay. It's filled with rust. Holy moly, it's all the way over here. Well, alright, well, finally we get a break from the stop north. Stop, start, stop, stitch, stop, stitch, stop. Yay. It's wood, it's wood, it's wood. No, speeding. Ted has rust all over his paint. Actually, we're going to build the train coast. Alright, let's say we're about to go through some mountains. So now it looks like we're. <laughs> Finally about to leave the LA metropolitan area and go through some deserts. I think. I don't know. <laughs> Clarkson! What Hammond? Go faster. I'm going to speed limit! Okay, but the speed limit's going up to 55 suits so you'll blah, 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 blah. Yay. And let's go back into single track. But wow, we saw another train! Yay! But only at a place where I guess the uh, the tracks are split. Alright, yeah, Vincent Great Acton is next. It looks like it's all the way at the end of what might be like a mountain range or something, so this is gonna get interesting. 
I guess the track goes straight, so... Yay. Alright, cool. So now we got another half an hour of just driving. Yay. Ah, oh, 39, really? Yeah, Mala. Ah, great crossing. Hmm, another freight siding, I guess. And yet, no freight trains. I did install, um, well, all the freight stuff, so. I'm just surprised we haven't seen one yet. Hmm. Oh, satellite thingy. Yeah, that's cool. Or no, satellite. Solar. So, 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 blah, 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 blah. Actually, I just realized. the So it says 17 miles to the next station. But really, that's 17 miles, I guess, straight line as the crow flies. So really, this month they're driving through between the station next to the lot longer. Just stupid. Ooh, a yellow bridge of some sort. Wait, what is this? sort of pipe bridge huh and also yellow bridge muscle no, I think everyone oh not this one move for some reason Something else I may as well mention is that apparently this route was touted as Con Pass meets uh, Peninsula Corridor. Even the gradients aren't that challenging. Well, half an hour to go to the next station. Yeah, so I guess this route is just mostly just single track. But with some double track sightings here and there, I guess, to allow trains to uh, pass each other. Otherwise, it's mostly just single track. Up, oh, speed up to 
and 44 in, in uh, 1.3 miles. really slow but at least this time we have a uh, we're going slow because these are some sharp curves and we're going to a tunnel This one is so slow. Another thing I will say about this route, though, I'm surprised at how long it is because there's actually quite a lot of scenery and detailing along this route, and yet it's 80 miles or 70 or it's a long route for trains and world standards. And yet they actually made a full route. Hmm. And into another tunnel. Oh, short one though. <laughs> what about till the is you from the interior camera? There we go. Oh, go up to 45. Alright, well, for now. Also, I wish this engine had a uh, cruise control. Considering, you know, how much speeding up and slowing down you do. With the elevation change and the uh, speed of the changes. Just make it a bit easier. Yes, Russell? Yeah, Mr. Bubbles is still here. Hey, did I am! Oh no, the bread machine has to return. Yay! I've been here, you bit. Then why haven't you said anything? Because. Uh huh. Hey, Russell! Don't break anything! Indeed. I think we're actually about halfway there. Ish. I see that bread machine return to the stream one more time. I will push him down the gulag once again. Uh huh. But really, he did. <clears throat> Oh, this middle section is so slow. Oh. 
interior looks nice though. So while you're traveling at the pace of the steel to your destination, at least you have stuff to look at. Maybe I'll spin it up to 29 coming up, but not like we were going that fast to begin with. Love trees. For Russell to not burn. That's it. Uh-huh. Jeffrey, what are you doing? I am getting rid of this bread machine once and for all. Uh-huh. Now with that taken care of, let's see what's up with this room. More twisties coming up, I guess. I think now we're in more of the like the Cajon Pass portion. As there's a lot of elevation change here, although um It's a bit easier to drive on though when you don't have like a million tons of freight to pull. Yeah. For today I think it was just a locomotive and four coaches. Now, I believe you can run freight services here in this game. So, eventually I'll give those a try and, uh... See if we can... Bang it or clang it. Those parts mainly just mounds and bushes and things. Oh, what's that? Oh, there's a little cart there. Huh. He's out there in the little in the middle of nowhere. Stupid the camera only goes this high.
Yeah, we're just winding through the mountains very slowly. Although we are getting kind of close to the end of twisties. And hey, the speed is about to go up. Of a 35, then a 45. And there's the speed limit increase. Well, in a little bit. What else is gonna last? Oh, okay, 45, but then 40 after a little while. Oh, that back down to 35, okay. So the middle part about it is basically all twisties and stuff. Yeah, I'll twist Vroni when I'm done. Now I'm gonna twist you. What? How did Bread Machine get back up here? Uh huh. Okay, bed day make break. You do realize I have teleportation, right? And I thought I broke it. Uh -huh. Not really. And you'll never will. Unless I use special tools. Special, <laughs> special tools. Hey, I was gonna say that. Uh huh. Well. I hate Jeffrey. I hate Jeffrey. I, I guess it turns out that me installing all the uh, all the Union Pacific stuff was for nothing because uh, I haven't seen a single freight train. Like, did they all evaporate or something? Anything that I can do, ten things you can better do. I have installed the um, UP Heritage Pack. He's the smartest. Yeah, so I got all of the necessary. I said, God, don't worry, I didn't buy it because torrenting. Right, Russell? No. Uh, but yeah, I just. Oi! But yeah, I just downloaded it for free because torrents. And, uh, but turns out even that was for nothing because guess what? They all died. In fact, in however many miles we've driven, we have seen a grand total 
of one train. And it was another metro link. You, you mean O one? Indeed. We haven't seen O one. Right. Yay! That's what you have. But we've not seen any freight trains, so I guess they all just uh evaporated into the air. One strike. Oh, we got a speed a bit increase at the fifty though. And Yay! We're gonna be able to go fast! Yay! Uh huh. I game. And now we're having lag starters. Oh, there we go. Let's just snort it. All right, cool. So we have an increase now up to forty, and that increase up to fifty. So yay, we can go faster. Yeah, we don't have to go so slow. I'm going to. Ah. Uh -huh. I'm going uh -huh. to poop poop on every. Uh huh. I'm going to peep peep on. <laughs> I'm going to peep peep on ten before we can do anything. Uh huh. Anyway, yay! Yeah, we're at least going a tiny bit faster. Right Game. Welcome to Lag Sim World. Jeffrey yeah, scared Ryan away. Uh huh. Oh yeah, one I'm thing worth. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, one thing worth mentioning. I am playing this on a supercomputer. By the way, this isn't some. This isn't Russell's uh fish computer or anything. No, this is a proper computer. So. uh... It's not really a proper computer. Your your mom. But yeah, that's our dovetail games. Yay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Jeffrey owes me money. Not really. And we're single track again. You know, I would have liked to have at least seen some freight train. Yeah, anyway, hello, random channel. Welcome to the stream. We're driving a slow commuter train on the Angelo Valley Line. We'll be right back. Jeffrey and I are gonna get some coal. Uh huh. But yeah, I was hoping to at least see at least one freight train, like going the other way, on a uh, on the like a siding or something. But no, we haven't even seen that. So I guess there's like no freight traffic on this line or something. And of course, it goes down to forty-seven. Well, this we're almost at a uh, Vincent Great Acton. And after that, one more stop, but then Leicester, which is st still a whole half hour away. Holy moly! We're almost there. Well, not quite. That way, you can get away from Jeffrey. Huh? Ah. Yeah. Huh. Okay, train, don't do anything. Stupid. You owe me money. Up, oh, speed of decrease. Yep, that will have to do. Yeah, there's a road. Okay, that was a terrible idea. Okay, no, give me a minute.
And I'm back. And I totally didn't try to uh, wee in a bottle. No. There we go. I get this. There we go. All right, let's keep going. Okay, at least now we have higher speed limits than where we were before. Get some speed on. What is this from civilization here? Smoke. Uh. Out of fifty four. There we go. Unless we have a uh, slow speed limit coming, we're actually going to arrive at the next station pretty quickly. Or pretty soon. Alright, let's finish this journey. Well, I'll say finish. So, uh, well, while yet to go, but we're getting there. Ooh, 75 is coming up. All right, three miles to go. Yeah, so I had to use the toilet really badly there. I actually have a bottle here that I tried to go into, but in the end it just caused more problems than it solved, so I figured that eh, just pause stream for a minute and then actually use the bathroom like a normal person does. Yeah, it looks like now we're exiting the most like the most twistiest parts of this uh this line. But yeah, installed uh, all the layers in hopes that we would see, you know, something. And all I really saw was the Santa Fe F7s at LA, plus the, uh, uh, those freight cars that were just sitting idle. And that's it. So... Your experience on this route won't change much, um, depending whether or not you have like any of the uh, of the layers, like the Con Pass or Sherman Hill or whatever.
I know, my search gonna get to the next station actually pretty close to the timetable. Um, <laughs> just have Bush on the track. Of course, there is. Are we changing lines here? I think we are. Oh, you are then about to arrive at the next station. We're here a bit early, but not too early. Hmm. So the Vincent Grade Acton mission. Uh. Surprising amount of passages here. Place for a station that's just kind of in the middle of nowhere. So where are we now, actually? We are... Okay, a little more twisty to get through, but then it actually becomes more... Actually, it's a straight line to wherever Lancaster is, actually. Oh, is it here? Huh. Okay. Interesting. So we're almost there. What a heck of a journey this was. Wait, what? They are a station now, Spooner. Oh, there's a map here. And let's me get that. Yeah, so we are now here. All right, Palmdale.
So 45 and 49. I'm going downhill. I don't have that much of that in a little while. Alright, oh, wasn't Hollywood supposed to be part of this route? Where's that at? Do we already pass it and I miss it or what? Also, we actually had a pretty steep downcline. To where I can set the train just coast. And then, but bit of time to break again. Oh, come on. There we go. Alright, it's been the 75 coming up, or 79. So, yeah, we're almost at the fast section. So, yeah, into the valley line. Nice scenery. Boring to drive on. Yeah. Yeah, in terms of other trains, you won't see many. Because most of it is actually single track. So you might run into a freight train. If you, you know, pick a service at the right time. But, uh, yeah. And the stuttering. All that's supported with dovetail. What's all? You owe me money. Oi, Russell, no crashing. Me crashing into Ryan's train. Awesome. Well, where is Ryan? We're almost at the end. Alright, should we increase 79? Yay! Alright. Speed. And fifty five. Oh, 
Hold on, then we'll break. There we go. Okay, so it's feeling decreased to 75, and then. Uh, I increase like I said, I guess once we get through this twisty bit. A lot of twisties on this line. Come on, slow down. Crossing. Give me 79. Hey, 79. Every year on the home stretch, almost there. All right, approaching Palmdale, second to last stop. You know, I'm so far away. Wow. All right, stop. Okay, good. Man, we are really stuttering this game. Oh, I got here early. Huh. Come on. Well, here we are then. Oh, pass is flying in the air. <laughs> Palmdale, second to last stop. Map. Yeah. We're almost there. Come on. So this is around here. Hmm, building. No mugsy by here. Well, what's this? Oh, boat. Uh dub trails. Obvious realized. Let's get some uh, gates closed up awfully soon. 
Hey, Rose, I'm totally not causing a traffic jam. What's that? Uh-huh. Yeah, so because I'm here, the gates are down. Even though I'm not even going to cross things for another minute. Clarkson! Hey, it wasn't my fault. Blame Dovetail. <sighs> Otherwise, this part's actually pretty quiet. So quiet I can even hear the crickets. Oi! No banging the coaches! That's my job. Not really. Anyway, um, F-125. Pretty cool engine, actually. I like the rolling stock we got here in this route. Too bad the route itself is very slow. And quite boring, too. I mean, to be fair, I mean, I wasn't sure what I was expecting, but... Yeah. Anyway, one stop to go. You mean one? Indeed. Seven and a half miles to go to Lancaster, which is actually a straight line. So let's go fast! What is that? Oh. Wait! Yeah, Horizon 5G! Well, that's something I didn't expect to see today. Is that a really reference to, uh. Oh. Japanese! Yeah, well. Wow, I've definitely had a bunch of interesting, uh. Wait, Chipotle less. Yeah, that's 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 fish. Your fish. I also did you see that anime um uh advertisement board? No. Get his screen out of it so Ryan can see. Speaking of which, where is Ryan? He himself. Vassal? Yep, come on. Okay, 20. Follow them. I'm going to game in you. Oh. Until you stop being stupid. Oh. You miserable idiot. Well then, I guess that's run on the final stretch of Lancaster. I guess we should give our uh, thoughts on the route then. So, hey, Rosa, what do you think about the uh, Trains and World Angela Valley line? Very boring and linear. Uh huh. Yeah, I must say, and uh, I wasn't really all that impressed by the uh, Vorlberg line, thinking that was kind of boring, but at least on the Vorlberg line, you saw other trains. I mean, they roll the same train, but at least you saw them. Here. This route is planned. Yeah, here, you don't even get that. You, you know, you just kind of just... I'm most of it a single track, okay, but, you know, I, I would have liked to seen at least more freight services and stuff, but... Nah. So, yeah. I guess if you're a big fan of Metrolink, or if you like driving through routes that are slow, but... Interesting. I guess I can kind of recommend it. But, um... Otherwise, if you're looking around with lots of diverse, um... Uh, diverse rail traffic, then this one is, uh, yeah.
I'd fun if I even installed all those layers I mentioned earlier, you know, to get more traffic in here, but no, even if you own like stuff like the con pass, well, any of the layers, um, you just won't see it unless you, I guess, pick the correct Metrolink service. But secretly, he loved Frony. And anyway, where's Ryan? We're about to arrive at our final destination. <laughs> Finally. Yep, two. Yeah, my time destination is me doing your mom. Oi! Anyway, we're about to get to Lancaster. So, guys. I we're not there yet. Yo, yeah, Although, remember to do the thing at the end. I won't. You will. Oh, that's flowing stuff. Alright, so I'm for the 40. Then red light. Come on, a bit more break. There we go. Oi. Oh, here we are. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, we're about to arrive at Lancaster. This is the last stop of this service. So make sure to take all of your belongings with you as you exit the train. Thank you for riding Metro uh, Metro Link. Uh, we hope to see you again soon. I gotta also gotta stop right before we get this platform over because of course we have a red light. Alright, Lancaster, the tippy top end of the Antelope Valley line. We finally made it. Yay! Oh, there's sure a buffer at the end as well, so actually if we went too fast, we would have the buffers. I get to bang the coaches. No, you don't. Alright, here we are! Final destination. And that was the Antelope Valley Line. Hooray, as there's another passage shooting up into the air. All right, I guess we'll complete the, uh... Oh, I guess everyone's getting back on the train now for some reason. I guess they're about getting ready for the return journey to LA, but we're not gonna do that in this live stream because this one's already been pretty long. Here it is, Lancaster. All right, come on. And lock the doors. That was being weird again. Ah, uh, passenger is still stupid. You're stupid. Anyway, yay! We did it. Wait, Give why? Give me off this train. Ha uh ha. -huh. Well, you can now exit the train as we're now at our final destination. Yeah, I got the silver Get away store. from me, Mr. Bubbles. No! Anyway, so that was 76.61 miles of distance, so almost 80 miles. But honestly, it felt like 700 miles with how long that was. 
Oh, I used to love we only waited that long until we go back. So, <laughs> only 50 minute wait so we could go back to LA. But I think I've had enough of this route for now. Alrighty then. So. Where's Ryan? Oops. Come on. Nar. No, I guess Ryan must be having dinner. Well, uh, oh well, we only need Russell for the closing anyway, so, yeah. Oh, wait, why don't you get Ryan's thoughts? Oh, well, you know what, maybe we can find out tomorrow or something. I don't know. Anyway, Russell, are you ready to do the closing? No. Make sure do the blowing thing. Anyways. Um, so there we go then. That is the Antelope Valley line here in Train Sim World 4. No. Oi! Russell, I didn't tell you to break the metal pipes. Anyway, yeah, as I was saying, that was the Antelope Valley line here in Train. Alright, that's it. You now have one. That's what I thought. That was it about your train to World 4, yeah, so overall... Alright, that's it. You now have... That's what I thought. Now, <laughs> that was the end to the battle here in Train Sim World 4. So, overall, my thoughts on this route... It's boring! Yeah, um... Just like you. Somehow this route is even more boring than the Borobark line. Because, hey, at least the Broberg line had some commuter trains, you can see, whereas this one has nothing. Um, yeah, so overall, I probably won't drive this route very often. In fact, I'll probably do a few more services and probably never touch this route ever again. But, hey, at least we have the one F-125, which I might use for this some things in my spare time. This game. And, you idiot, you said you were going to buy it later or something. I was lying. Yamala! Well, hopefully they'll make a crack for this game so we can torrent it! Yay! No. Uh huh. Anyways, um, yeah. So, uh, at least it's actually went better. So there's that much. So then we have one more planned, scheduled Train Sim World Four live stream to go. That's right. There is one more stream to go here in the Train Sim World Four saga for now. Tomorrow. We'll be back on Train Sim World 4, and we'll take a look at the third of the new routes on the East Coast Main Line. Yeah, which I'm actually really looking forward to, as I'm actually a really big fan of the East Coast Main Line. So I can't wait to do that tomorrow. We'll be driving the uh, Class 801 Azuma, and of course, the one that I think we're all excited for, the Flying Sausage. Right, Russell? Russell? No. Haha. Uh -huh. Um, after that, though, I'm not sure... What else we're gonna do here on Train to World 4? Um, oh yeah, apart from the editor, well, okay. Well, pro I'll, I'm probably gonna do some editor live streams and things at some point later on, but, um, yeah. Uh, but like I said, tomorrow is the final confirmed Train to World 4 live stream. After that, I'm not sure what the next Train to World 4 live stream will be, but we shall see. But that will do it for this live stream. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time... Look out for the blue Japanese train! I said, look out for the blue Japanese train! Russell! No. That's your cue to blow on the microphone! I lost my breath. Well, do something. Scream! Ah! Uh. Ah!